And these players on fours and now have a lot of angles to consider. The smoke's blocking them out from a lot of the peaks they would have wanted to take. And this is great ground control right off the bat by Liquid, a kill, and a spike plant. But you know, a bit of HP loss for Cryptics. Well, yes. Stake by a lot of damage. Actually maintaining Shower's control, but unfortunately punished for it. Yujin actually going to come through. Yampi will fall here. Upgrade to the Frenzy. Soulcast can be really careful now outside lamps. Oh, Artis got those right clicks. No, he doesn't. He goes down right away. Zeddy with the Link. trade back. And we're in an even position, but it's Link that's going to be the difference maker, surely. Soulcast up close. Time starting to tick away. It's already halfway to fuse, though. That Molly is going to stop anyone it. from going through the wall. And they're able to just defuse it. Oh my, what a in Liquid are kind of forced to, to make a push pretty soon. It doesn't necessarily have to be A. The Ampi falls and Spike is down, so they might not have much of a choice. Curious sending the Spike through Bath, and with that completely isolated, this is going to be a full rotate from Forza. And what should be a clear-cut round now, one pick for Solkus. He's immediately shut down. Artist farming up that Hunter's Fury as we speak. 5 HP left, and oh, he'll go down in the end, but... Actually, they're going to three-man walks into showers here. Look at this, the TP play, Mitch. Complete crunch. Scream is dealing with it well, but the numbers are just too great. Zeddy with a double pulls it into a pretty advantageous spot for Forza, considering what they started with. Liquid, they're going to be a little bit, a little bit stuck, especially with Link playing towards that B side. They know that he's rotated through the spawn. And they could be watching for that flank play a little bit later. I mean, now it's going to be about running that clock down. Aware of the possibility, Yampi will spring the trap, finally shows his hand. Find the first, but again, Forza just looking for damage at this point. Honestly, found the two kills initially. Can't escape with that weapon. Zeddy, the last man standing here. More challenging. Yampi finds the third. It's in bat, they could put a pull or a stun in there. Look at Zeddy! He's gone pushing down middle! He's an Astra player! Goes in, Yampi's ready to fight though, and there's Coffee down right away. Snake bite and shock dart, but Yampi dashes out of the way. So he won't be taken down by it, but he's left on 75 health. And with Scream falling, the numbers are really thinning out here for Liquid. No ultimates to pull them back into these fights. They need to rely on raw aim duels, and now there's a Viper's Pit to contend with as well. Lamb's control is basically out of the question at this point. Unless they manage to somehow deal with Hudgen, so they'll look oh. elsewhere for control. An artist is waiting for them. Another creeping through the smoke as it dissipates. Link somehow gains the upper hand. And with that, the plant is in. Cryptics tucked in on the corner behind the double boxes now stands as the last bastion for this attacking side. A spike not quite planted for him. He's hoping to catch Viper coming out or absolutely any opportunities, but now blinded up as well. They know exactly where he is. They're ready to take this fight. He goes in, but Hudgens watching and waiting. Another attackers, Ultimate as you'd close. expect. <laughs> Other rounds have gone. Sulcus is just sending it after coffee, but the Spectre reigns supreme in the close range duel. It looks like a flash through the smoke is on the cards, but Yampi steps oh in before Hudgen can even press his W key. Can't even get close to his keyboard as he goes down. You will not kill us. We got that one back online. It's actually Yampi now. Gonna pile on the pressure. The smokes will drop though, and this is where, with everything invested, they could have nothing to sit behind. Yampi tries to go aggressive, but Zeddy will shut that down as well. Coffee sits inside the Molly for some reason. Will fall there. That comes to a 2v3 here. Liquid star placement? This could work out. Oh, they run into a judge, though. Never mind. Scream is just <laughs> sat there waiting, and it is just free low when it. Might catch falls by surprise. Oh, maybe not. That flash around, but there's no follow up on it. So Getsu, not quite able to land it. Now the movement in towards the site. You're going to have blast packs in, but Zeddy's closed the distance already with a judge in hand. The blast pack got him! Sulkus killed him on his way through! A freak accident that robs Forza of their best chance of defending that B site. Great shock dart, good damage, but there needs to be a follow up here. They are retake. Liquid don't really give too much away in the early round. They kind of wait for any of these tells from Forza's. Actually, Coffee gets very deep. So there's that orbital strike in lamps. Actually, Artis gonna shut down Soulcast there. Oh! Nice shot on the back of the reveal, right through the smoke. Hudgen able to take one, the pre-fire up on top. They're deep, they want to force the plant out. See how Liquid play this now. Not really in a position to be aggressive enough to find a pick. 
And they were holding the bath crawls as well, so so much information to play with here for Forza's. They come back in, great flash, and down goes Cryptics from the flank play. Now Screen's got so much to consider on this one, and Artist is the one to take him down. Very patient round from the entirety of being towards... He actually will lean towards challenging, yep. Anything with the Hunter's Fury still online, as you said, that is a big threat gravity to this planet. Oh, that's so good! The gravity well in, stops them planting, allows the tag to come through. Sagetsu pushes in at the right time. There's only five seconds left. They have to commit to this plant. If they can delay it, if they can cancel it, the round is over. Zedio gets caught by Yappy from afar and caught these TP! It's a dangerous, dangerous thing. In comes the orbital strike. It's just free information. They know they're probably not getting a kill off the back of it. The showstopper, on the other hand, there's going to be different expectations, and he's off down by Hudgen before he can get anything done. A second shot connected by the Viper. Lothar called it on the desk. He said, watch out for this Viper operator, but hey, he's dealt with eventually, leaving Sagetsu alone. A 1v3 in the first kill already gone his way. Link tucked up close, and Cryptic's incredibly low. If Sagetsu gets this first kill, it could be done, but Link comes in huge on that okay I, I thought i was going insane love that sound <laughs> well gabby's found the opening coffee down. especially with how look at where zeddy is this is going to be a, a i would say a free plan but there's 10 seconds left and they're pushing out uh, what's going on for forza here they've given up so much control there's five seconds left and artist is alone this round is done I, it's Uh, the fact that Scream, uh, again, at this point, is almost 30 seconds left. Nobody coming in to stop them. That delays a little bit, but they still get it down. Well, actually, the Viper will invest a very late here, Link. <laughs> Trying to charge down with the Judge. We'll find Coffee. Actually, some trades coming through. It's two for two here for Forza. They're not giving up just yet. In fact, Zeddy gets all four. Oh, my. He closes it out. He in terms of the economy there, and look at that. Yampi goes for an aggressive peak. Shut down immediately here. Drastically. Horses are gonna just go for this plant, not hunting down the frags, and as they Wait, come through what? the wall, they've run right into cryptics! How have they let him away with that? The showstopper basically to secure the round, taking down Hudgen, and Artist is a 1v3. That just is never gonna Hudge. You can see me, that's fine. I'll still kill you. And Sulcus, oh well, he's only good for the one. But shut down, but Yampi's able to find another. Now it's all about playing that retake. Yampi is kinda trapped. Stuck inside of Lamps, but it doesn't look like Forza are looking to push him just yet. As I see Artist edge closer, there's the ultimate there chasing him down. So, oh, <gasps> oh, Artist tried to follow up there. Yampy's gonna punish oh! him. He gets down again. He finds the third, Mitch. Oh! What is this round? What a way to close it, man. You know, especially when you look at what they're dealing with in, in terms of, like, if you just save your ultis up, you've got an orbital strike, you've got a showstopper, you've got Scream on a res, you've also just got Scream in general. So, all retake, Solkus is desperately looking for a headshot to get that showstopper online and give them an opportunity. It could be the judge, couldn't it? Oh, no, Link able to run in and get one, but he's left on 5 HP. I mean, surely he doesn't get much more done with that, and down on sight, Yampi deals with Zeddy, the shots from Scream, no landing eventually, and this is starting to roll, no Team Liquid's way. way, the Bucky in with a kill, the wall to get the defuse, and if you want to stop that artist, you're going to have to deal with this Bucky, the kill comes in, no but he's way. taken down right after, this should be an easy defuse for, <gasps> it wasn't gone halfway. But he still has time. He's got, he's got plenty of time. Usually play. Um, as I say that, he's walking mid right now. He's going to find Zeddy. Try and line up the second. He's going to do just that. That's the start you want, Mitch. Yeah, you could say that's an ideal start. Gets even better when Yampi and Link are able to combine to take down Coffee. And what a shot to Hudgen. Artist is left alone. He started towards the B side. And he'll finish there. As he looks to... I mean, I wouldn't say he's looking to save. He's just waiting to see what happens at this point. There's five players to play up against, and you know full well they're going to be hunting you down. And it's Scream to take it. Well, the players, though, stuck outside there, and one more to isolate, but look at that, Coffee. I find two with the classic, nothing else, but... I'm going to... In position now to try and sit behind the box. Link's got to be the one to take all that pressure. Actually, trading back and forth here. It's only down to Scream and Cryptix. Scream will respond. Luckily, still got that Vandal online. They go for a couple more taps and getting comfortable now, getting warmed up. A little bit of aim ready. 
forced to stand behind here. Artist actually playing a little deeper here. And Dampy trying to close the distance with a judge here. Yeah, look at that screen swing through. Empress online going to be able to dismiss away here. And Liquid will get this plant comfortably, Mitch. Yeah, a really weird round from Forza. They don't play yeah. on site. They play heavier towards A with Viper, with Cypher. Then they're playing two players off site on B, being the Cypher and the Soba. Uh, not fully with that strategy. Team Liquid have overrun the side. They've got a Viper wall that's now down, so they'll look to make the push. But look, can't be sold and close with a judge. Yep. And they have absolutely no clue. Now they do the info pretty costly what a good trade back Sagetsu with the double and it's now doable they need to get that diffuse in Sagetsu keeps on giving it's already halfway stuck the cloudburst dissipates but it doesn't matter coffee has every angle back to hold it marshall in hand good tag on to zeddy good so tag on to hudgen too many bodies behind that zeddy gonna be able to get healed up see here artist as well that back down to about 50 HP here, but he's played his life effectively. Cryptics will find one. And that's the artist, a little bit of a slip up, but still finds that. Screen will fall. Now to just Soulcast and Cryptics now. And they're a little split, Mitch. Last player standing. That they are. With Soulcast being the final man. He needs the headshots. The third already found. In goes the shock dart. It's dealing damage. But is it enough? The Seeker coming in to find him and slow down that defuse. And he's done it. He's already won the round. What an incredible one. The Marshall deployed, though. Always. When it comes to Breeze, especially. Oh, that was almost two players down right at the start. In fact, it still might be Sagetsu. Does a good job to recover. An artist comes in to help. That's he gave up the angle for just a moment. He spotted the head there. Oh, maybe looking at the minimap or something there. Because artist finds a freebie. Oh, that scared me. The snake bite coming out in an inopportune moment. Blink is dealt with. This gives them so much freedom to play a little bit more stacked on the A side. And in fact, you, you notice that Viper up close. Zeddy in a position that he gets wall banged out of zero information just a guess and it works out for link spotted here coffee's in a lot of trouble and he, oh wow this is clean team liquid have just completely rolled over forza and it doesn't look like they're even looking to let the save happen yampi is waiting here with the bulldog and although he'll be caught he has another player quite close by link wanting to get in and take these weapons out of their hands that cypher utility comes in huge on this save though Deep, but not anymore. Scream over the top. We'll find the first, and just a matter of time. There you go, Link. We'll find it. Artist, huge advantage, and Team Liquid would be running right into a heavy stack that's staring straight at them in a choke point. Luckily, Yampi opens up the space on that late halls lurk that we saw. A scream and cryptics fall. Yampi has a lot of pressure on his back, and he's not able to deliver this time around. Forza completely wiping the floor with this A push. And Link is the final man alive, trying a little bit of a mid-play. Had great success towards Doors. This time he's been spotted. And Coffee takes him down quickly. Five to three. Aldo will be there to definitely confirm the information. I like what Hudgen's doing. Changing up his trap wire spots every round. Now, what? That well, was actually uh, disgusting from Zeddy. I'm at a loss. <laughs> And the secondary objective damage done at least. Uh, yeah, okay. Left. Wasn't clean, but got it off. The Seeker's actually going to be invested here. Okay, going to try and recover Bad this line. round here. Cryptix is actually in with the spike over towards B main. He's found another kill. Coffee will fall. This is suddenly and scarily starting to look doable as Sulcus falls and leaves Cryptix alone and on 10 HP. And tag. Well, so he's he's gone. <laughs> With no time at least. Force is not giving anything away. He's Wait. in their spawn! What? How did yeah, he get Link find the kill as well? I don't know how Link managed it. That was a spam over towards the connector that I was pretty sure there was a smoke down on, but Okie dokies. <laughs> Three versus three. Scream recovered an operator. This is where things get very dangerous. This man now playing on the back side looking for some players to claim heads on. And he can bail out immediately if he connects the shot. But he doesn't. Now Cryptic's up close. Ghost in hand. He finds the first. And it's no only way. one remaining. A clean finish. Trouble. His dash is already used up. The walls are blocking his vision. Scream. Good for the first. He's going to get back to the site nice and safely as Viper's Pit is erected. And Team Liquid... 
Oh, they even get another pick. I mean, yeah. this looks like Forza might almost contemplate a save. They're still going for it, and every player is just dropping. I don't know how you feel about Hudgens' chances here. Not great. Now, the wall invested this side. We've got three members of Fours now. The Blade Storm. What by Sugetsu, and he's looking for something outside shop. Oh, and, and find he's it. finding it. My, oh, oh my oh, God. Oh, three. Well, looking for something. I can hear that. Oh, okay, well, oh, I spoke too soon. <laughs> I was going to say, they're, they're set so up aware here. that Link could be yeah. pushing. <laughs> <laughs> they're set up to <laughs> greet Link in this. Lump it out on mid, but instead it's four guys grouped up. Flash out, doesn't blind, and the oh. shot doesn't connect. Dash still online. He has the chance to get out of here. There's the first shot, dashing into the corner. Updraft as well, he's still alive. Yampi in with oh. another. There's the blade storm okay. to finish it, though. Sagetsu comes in to save the day. Giving up all that space. Oh, Coffee just missed that. Coffee just missed Yampi crossing. Oh, the barrels are spotted. That's a free kill. And there's two players here. Zeddy learns that the hard way as the flash comes to hunt him down. Good control for Team Liquid. Good spray by Scream. He's still up and at him and taking down Sagetsu. He eventually falls, but with Zeddy on 4 HP being spammed through the wall, it's a big play by Hudgen needed. Still undetected towards the back of the site, but Yampi quickly deals with him and puts eight on the split is imminent. She screamed, look at that. He gets ahead of the wall. He's gonna find that one, but actually the ping. They come back to buy him in the ass, and actually Coffee finds two. Yeah, that was huge. Opening it up through the double doors now into a three versus four shot. Ringing out. I didn't think I could like this man anymore. Oh, well, you well, need to know the angle. You can spray yeah. that at Yampi. Now he's in trouble. They're pushing him down. Oh, no. That has fallen apart a disservice. Oh, no. To the best weapon in the game of the Odin, making it look like it's uh, no more than a pea shooter. Drop out. Oh, Sagetsu is being heard the whole time. And another coming down. They're trying to take the fights against Solkus and not just to clean up two before dropping. There's still two players on this A side. That door's opening up now. Hudgen walking out oh, and he was out no. of ammo! Oh, oh, he's reloaded in the open! Well, that's a disaster and Screen cleans up another double to leave Zeddy by himself. And he has got the Viper's Pit online and the spike. Down. But somehow I think this one's going to be a little bit too much to ask. Hold on. He's managed to avoid the operator a second time. And now the Viper's Pit goes up. I might be eating my words in a second. We've got a clean plan again. Look at this. Cryptics and Link very far away from this. He's got a little bit of utility to play around outside the ultimate. Looks like he's going to try and post up and catch Liquid off guard, but there's nobody coming through spawn, Mitch. It's double doors and A-Main. Pit's gone. He didn't step back in. Pit is completely gone. He's repositioned behind the wall. Zeddy is playing some big brain games, but they've spotted him, and now they're ready to peek together. He needs to reposition, oh, oh. but he wasn't run on just his one HP. Wait, he's still stood there. Goodbye. That's that's the freest kill of Scream's life, a one HP player that hadn't even been shot yet. Oh, no. no. It's ready and waiting. Zeddy will fall. Another two members. Four stacked up behind. Uh, mm, yeah, a little sloppy. Ahead of the flash. And the control to play off of Artist. He spotted that barrel. Tucked down Yampi. There's only three opponents left. And Viper's still inside her pit. Flash out of this Viper's pit as they take back sight. The coffee's hiding as long as Artist stays alive. Oh, no. oh now coffee is to do it all. He's stuck on the backside, but they don't know where he is. Viper's still inside the pit, clearing it out. Coffee gets the first time on his side, but a good peek by Cryptics. They have to make a comeback on this map, win the next. This is where things get pretty tough, and this is the round they want to commit to. Find something the Hunter's Fury blindly pop finds nothing, but the push from Solkus receives the same treatment. They're even going to spot the player up close here. Cryptics now under heavy, heavy pressure, blinded up by the Seekers. A great execute by Forza. They overrun B, and now the retake is once again left down to Team Liquid, this time in a 2v4, though. The Yampi is over the operator. Bladestorm available if he finds one, potentially. Might look to try and turn this back in their favor, but lots of ground to cover. Zeddy going to catch him on the cross there. Link as well. Really up close and personal, but lots to deal with here. And that's now in the open. Oh, Solkus! Solkus! Do 
double headshot seeker sent out finding the victims coffee up close zeddy behind the pyramid they have all that they need to make no this way. work because yampi closes the distance the dash oh it's disrespectful leaving hunchin all alone but he still gets the first and oh, all the way three kill they clutch by hunchin that mid push the flash makes them turn we've or at all else we're gonna find zeddy Getting a little bit aggressive outside of B. Look at this again now. Ball's open on that, but wow, coffee will fall. Artists will trade that out. Just cryptics left now. Hold on to B site for liquid. Hudgens positioning in these duels is so good. He thinks he's clear. It didn't spoil Yampy though. 30 yeah, seconds did. left. Yeah. They were posted up in remaining. window now, but Solcast, look at that. Whoa, they're baiting him out for the time. See, the, well the worst part about that for Hudgen is there is literally... And Yampi staying in window as long as he did, going unnoticed as well. But uh, you're right, Soulcast being, I guess, male. He's being tagged on the way. Sprays not quite connecting for Soulcast, but Yampi comes out wide on the right side. They're hunting him down, pursuing him, and eventually dropping him to the floor. Numbers even. Plant possible screen, though. Looks to swing and take a free kill even more. Going his way. Nothing but headshots from this man. Hutchins spotted on the fade back. Great flash. And there we go.